Hi, welcome to a dyno video today. We'll get into the noisy fun bit in a minute, but I thought it's worth talking through the spec of this special little engine because it's a little bit different. If you haven't checked out our S Pack um, walk around video, please do that and I'll give you a bit more insight into the kit and what it's all about. But this engine essentially looks the same, but it's quite special. It's only 999cc, so the customer of this engine has to run in a class where you can have a 1400cc normally aspirated or, a, or less than a 1000cc turbocharged, boosted, supercharged, whatever. So he chose to come with us for a, um, for a Roadtrex S-Pack style conversion uh, for good, good reason. They're drivable, um, you can use normally aspirated tune and work really well. You'll see all of that later on in the video. Um, so this has got a genuine new old stock 970 Cooper S crankshaft in it, uh, or literally brand new. Um, it's, got our, it's got a set of custom con rods from ourselves in it which are longer than 6 inches with a, a little, little short piston on the top. Flat top piston, all the combustions in the cylinder head. Uh, it's got a 280 degree camshaft, uh, one and a half roller rockers. The head is our, well, that's our standard S Pack style head, but it has uh, 36 31 valves with 6mm valve stems, titanium top caps, quite high poundage springs, so it's a very light drivetrain to suit the revability and um, the nature of the, of the revs this engine is going to live at in its use. So quite a mild camshaft spec, but we did that because it's only 1000cc and you've got to really try and balance what you're doing with it. It's got our standard um, large pulley on it um, because we were aiming for one bar, just a little bit over one bar of boost on this thing at peak revs. Other than that, it is, yeah, it's our, it's our little, um, little S-Pack kit, which works fantastically. So um, have a look at the video. We were running, I'll run some, some, through some figures. We, at peak power, it's running just over one bar boost. Uh, towards its over rev capability, it's running 1.2 bar boost, but it makes max power at what, uh, just over one bar. So just over 14, 15 PSI. And um, as our Australian friends say, she's a ripper. Thanks and hope you enjoy the video.